everybody, Rising Storm here. Hi, Cancers, how you doing? So I'm going to be doing your love reading from now until the end of January in regards to your love lives, okay? So I'm going to be looking into your overall view, your energies, the person that you're dealing with, why is all happening, and the possible outcome from now until the end of January. Okay, so give me a storyline that would resonate for my Cancers. Please give me uh, a storyline that would uh, resonate What's going on with cancers in regards to their love lives? Give me an overall view, your energies, cancer, the person that you're dealing with, why it's all happening, and the possible outcome for now until the end of January. So what's going on for cancers, please? Give me an overall view, your energies, the person that you're dealing with, why it's all happening, and the possible outcome from now until the end of January, please. What's going on with you, cancers? What's going on with cancer, cancer, cancer? All right, let's see what's going on here. So... Your overall view, Cancer, is the magician. You could be dealing with the Virgo. So I see you trying to manifest certain things into your reality here. Um, you could be trying to manifest certain things. You, you have the Queen of Wands. So there was some type of ending here. You could be dealing with the Scorpio or Fire sign. You have the Queen of Wands here, right? could be dealing with the Fire sign. So there's some type of ending happening between you and the person that you're dealing with, all right? And the person that you're dealing with, how, it could be Libra as well. You have the Justice in reverse and the Queen of Cups in reverse. So whoever this person is, they're kind of being closed off emotionally towards you. All right. They're not opening up if um, that's if that's the case here. So they're kind of distancing themselves towards you. For some of you, I'm getting there's more than one person involved here. All right. Because you have two queens for some of you cancers. OK, why is what happening? So you have the Ten of Wands in reverse. So there's a burden that you're trying to basically let go of. All right, cancer. All right, so for some of you, you could be trying to manifest something right now into your reality. There's definitely an ending that happened between you and the person that you're dealing with, okay? You could be dealing with a fire sign or or a water sign, but or it could be a Libra as well. But whoever this person is that you're dealing with, they're being emotionally unavailable or emotionally closed off towards you. And why it's all happening in the Ten of Wands, so you're basically trying to let go of this burden here. So why is the magician here? Please clarify the magician. Why is this here for the zodiac sign of Cancer? Why is this here, please? Why is this here? You have the Ten of Swords. So, okay, so there's definitely, um, there's definitely uh, an ending that happened. Something is ending or has ended or is about to end for some of you. Okay, there was some, some, there was some type of uh, trickery or some type of manipulation going on between you and the person that you're dealing with. Okay, somebody could have been being played or someone has gone played. All right, so there's some type of betrayal that happened here. So why is the Queen of Wands, clarify the Queen of Wands, why is this here, please, why is this here, why is the Queen of Wands here? So you have the Ace of Cups in reverse, so for, this, for some of you this could be unrequited love, okay, but it looks like the love isn't there anymore between you and the person that you're dealing with, alright, so... It looks like this could be unrequited love or the love isn't there anymore and there's just definitely, there's definitely an ending that happened between the two of you. So why is the death card here? Some of you could be dealing with the Scorpio. I got water sign, Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, air sign, Libra, Aquarius, or Gemini. I got Virgo here and Libra as well. Okay. So why is the death card here? Clarify the death card. Why is this here, please, for the zodiac sign of Cancer? Why is this here? You have the five of pentacles in reverse. So someone, it looks like someone came back around to you or hasn't or will come back around to you, okay, even though this is a done deal between the two of you. All right, so the love isn't there anymore like it used to be, all right? So someone is eventually going to come back around to you. You may be coming back around to someone or someone may be coming back around to you, all right? You could be dealing with an earth sign here as well. So why is the justice here in reverse, please? Clarify the justice. Why is this here? You have the five of swords in reverse. For some of you, there's an apology happening or um, you're waiting for an apology or some sort of, you know, reconciliation or, or some sort of a sorry here. So why is the justice here in reverse? Please clarify this for the zodiac sign of cancer. Why is this here? You have the four of cups. So whoever this person is, they seem pretty bored. All right. Whoever you were dealing with, they were bored in this situation. And they're just basically closing themselves off to you right now, or they're being emotionally unavailable. All right. With the four of cups, you'll be dealing with another water sign. But they look like they're very much bored and, and kind of detached towards you. So why is the queen here, please? Clarify the queen. Why is this here? And reversed. Why is this here in reverse? Why is this here? You have the Ten of Cups in reverse as well. So this 
whoever, the, whoever this person is that you're dealing with, it looks like this drains them more than it fulfills them. So they're really not happy emotionally wise and they're just basically closing themselves off towards you. And it kind of feels as if this person is not interested in an offer from you or they're just bored in this connection. Okay, so it's all happening to the Ten of Wands. So you're just basically trying to get over this burden. All right, there was some type of betrayal that led to a burden between the two of you. All right, or betrayal that led to an ending is what I want to say. But it looks like someone you want to come back around to someone, something that ended between the two of you. You could have been dealing with uh, more, uh, you know, multiple people in this, in this case, okay? So why is the Ten of Wands here in reverse? Clarify the Ten of Wands here. Why is this here, please? Why is this here? Why is the Ten of Wands here? Clarify this for me for the Zodiac sign of Cancer. You have the page. So even though you are trying to get yourself out of feeling this burden or you're trying to drop this burden from this ended relationship between you and the person that you're dealing with, it kind of looks like you still want to... Someone here is trying to still offer you something or there will be an offer still being had. It looks like someone wants to come back around to you. There's a situation that's already done with and that already is ended. For some of you, this could be unrequited love or the love isn't there anymore between you and the person that you're dealing with. Okay, but at the same time, it's like you're trying to drop this burden, but, you know, there's some type of offer being made or there's going to be an offer being made here. Okay, so why is the page here? Clarify the page for one more. Why is this page here, please? Why is this page here? The Nine of Swords in reverse. You're dealing with another air sign here. So it's kind of, it's, it's kind of like you're borderline trying to basically get over this or drop this situation you're so it's kind of like you are you're no longer in your head or stuck about this stuck on this situation like restless nights you're no longer in that and you're trying to drop the burden but at the same time you do want to offer this offer something to someone or someone's going to come back around to you where there, where there was a situation that ended you know, to offer you something. Someone wants to come back around to you. I feel like, you know, the love isn't there anymore like it used to be, okay? Or this could be unrequited love. So what's the possible outcome from now until the end of January, please? What's the possible outcome from now until the end of January for the zodiac sign of Cancer? What's happening here? What's the possible outcome here? So you have the Queen of Swords. Oof. So I'm seeing someone cut someone off. Cancer, you either cut this person off or they cut you off. Someone cut somebody off here. If that's the case, then you have, there's just too many women. You have, I, I'm thinking this is a third party situation you're involved, you got yourself involved in. Because there's more than one queen. You have the queen of swords, the queen of uh, wands, and you have the queen of cups. So for some reason, I'm getting the feel like there was somebody else involved in the situation. Someone's going to come back around to you to offer you, though, but it kind of feels like you're trying to get yourself out of this burden or out of this frustration of being stuck in your head or you're in the process of doing it. But at the same time, someone wants to offer you some type of um, someone wants to offer you something at the same time. Someone kind of come back around to you. But the person that you deal with is kind of bored. They're feeling bored of the situation. And they're just basically closing themselves off emotionally because this emotionally drains them. So they're definitely not happy about this. So what's the possible outcome here, please? What's the possible outcome from now until the end of January? Give me two more cards and then I'll clarify them. All right. You have the Ace of Swords. So there might be some sort of clearing of the air or some type of truthful communication that might transpire between the two of you, okay? So there might be some type of truthful communication coming or some type of clearing of the air, okay? So I don't know if you cut this person off or somebody cut you off for here, um, Cancer. Well, let me get one more, please, one more, one more. This is, this is confusing. You have the Seven of Swords. So someone here is being deceptive. Someone here is being deceptive, acting deceptive. Someone here could be a huge player. It looks like there's somebody else in the middle of this uh, this love triangle, okay? So eventually I'm seeing you might get some type of truth or some type of clarity, but whoever you're dealing with, it could be you, Cancer, or the person that you're dealing with. They're, they're acting sneaky. They're very this dumb. <laughs> deceitful okay and they might be like there might be a player this person could be a player it could be you or the person that you're dealing with here 
So why is it, you're gonna end up cutting this person off like completely. So why is the Queen of Swords here, please? Or somebody cut somebody off here. Why is the Queen of Swords here? Clarify this for me, please. Why is this here? So there's gonna be multiple options out there, okay? So once you completely cut this person off, like completely, you're gonna have multiple options out there. It looks, it looks like you're gonna have some type of clearing of the air or some type of truthful communication here. Why is the Ace of Swords here? Clarify the Ace of Swords. Why is this here, please? Why is this here? The Star card. So it kind of looks like to me, once you get some type of truth or some type of clarity, it looks like you're gonna you're gonna be on your way to having some type of healing. It could be you or the person that you're dealing with. Okay, so once you get this truth or this clarity here, you could you could be on your way to healing because whoever, whoever you're dealing with, they're very sneaky, they're very deceptive. They could have possibly has you in a third party situation here that you are trying to get yourself out of or, you know, but in a way, I'm still seeing someone still trying to offer you something. It could be you or the person that you're dealing with. Okay. So that's what I got for, for cancers. You know, if, uh, it resonated, please like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below. Let me know. Um, if you guys would like a private reading, my email is in the about me section on my YouTube page and my PayPal link is in the description down below. Happy New Year to everybody. Thank you so much for watching. Like, share, subscribe, and I will see you guys on the next video.